Hey guys, it's Stella here, and welcome back to another one of my videos. And today, well, we are playing. Five Nights at Freddy's. So, how is everyone today? I am so sorry I haven't posted in a while. I'm just a very busy person who does not take the time to make videos. I apologize about that. Tomorrow I'm going to be posting another video. I actually have it already edited and stuff, but I just never post it. It would be connected to my controller and then you guys can't hear me as well, but we'll just see. Okay, so let's just get started. Hello, so I figured out how I'm going to do this. Um, hopefully you can hear me well. Um, so we're going to start a new game. And actually, let me just tell you a little secret right now. I thought I was recording this whole time. I did a full round and I was not even recording. Like, uh. Okay, let's, let's just get on with it. Okay. Family Pizzeria looking for a security guard to work at the night shift, which is us. We're, we're the night guard. 12 a.m. first night. Okay. Let's. Hopefully. Okay, so. This is gonna call us, yeah. I learned the controls from the last round, but, um, never got the time. But I didn't record because my luck. Hello? Hello? Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up That's my last week now, as a matter of fact, so I, I know it can be a bit overwhelming. <gasps> But I'm going to tell you that there's nothing to worry about. You'll do fine. So let's just focus okay. on getting you through your first week. Okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. It's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage or death has occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. They get quirky at night. Okay. You sing, those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children and we need to show them a little respect, right? Okay. Yeah. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up, they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, oh. Now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wires, and electronic devices, especially around the facial area. 
so you can imagine how having your head forcibly pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth when you pop out the front of the mask. Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first station of the breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. Alright, good night. Good night, sir. Okay, so basically we have to make sure these animatronics right here, they don't come and try and kill us. And we gotta make sure we can hear them and, um, and see them. We know where they are at all times. If we don't... Oh, okay. That, that's the bunny rabbit. His name is Bonnie, I believe. It's a... I don't know the gender. Okay. So we just gotta keep an eye on him, make sure he doesn't kill us. Um. So. It's a very bad idea for us to, um. You know, to work here. The night shift. But, you know what? It, it, it's fine because we're here now. It's, I just well get it over with. It's 2 a.m. Um. We have to try and get to 6 a.m within a good amount of time, you know, like, without dying, so. Did you hear that? We're at 53% power. <gasps> He's moving. When, when it blacks out like that, that means that they're moving. He's right there. See his body. Phew! <coughs> Don't sneeze, Stella. Don't sneeze. I kept on forgetting to press that button. I keep on forgetting it's B and all that. Why? Still there. Come on, go away, sir. It's 4 a.m. I gotta save my power now. It's 5 a.m. Still there. Okay. I'm just 
don't know where Chica Oh, there's Chica. Okay. Now we know where all of them are. He's there. She's there. Come on, it's 5 a.m. We got this for 14 percent. Is he not there anymore? again so we're going to be moving on with night two um i'll try my best to squeeze in as many rounds as i can um i'm not gonna do like super long but here we go night two 12 a.m so basically last time I think Bonnie started coming out at 2 a.m. So we gotta keep an eye out at 2 a.m. And this time we're gonna try and save as much power as we can because we were at, oops, did not. <laughs> because we were at 8% last time. So I did not mean to exit out. Okay, okay. well. Anyways, so we're just gonna chill here, you know, it's our strategy. Um, we're just gonna try and save as much power as we can. Oh, okay, Bonnie's already here, hi. Anyways, he's not gonna move at 2 a.m., he's gonna move at 12 a.m. Where'd he go? Dude, he's already here. Ooh, we're moving quick. What is that? I'm scared. Maybe Chica will stop moving it today. You know. You never know what could happen. I'm trying to see power, but I'm not good at that. It's 1 a.m. But okay. Why do I get scared by that? Come on. 
Hello. Where's Bonnie? It's 2 a.m. We got this, okay? I'm sorry I'm not talking that much because I'm like trying to concentrate, but you know me, I'm terrified. Gotta keep an eye on her because we don't want to die today. Uh, who's dum 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 Go away! Creep. I'm terrified. Go away, it's only 4 a.m. and I barely have any power. <laughs> Why does that scare me? <laughs> um, Stop haunting me. 22% power. So fun. <laughs> so fun. I'm just gonna keep taking these lights. That's all I do right now. Okay. I'm trying to save as much power because we only have 19% and it's only 4 a.m. We have two more hours to get. <laughs> oh. Uh oh, it's jammed. We're gonna get a jump scare. I knew it was coming, okay? I knew it was coming. Why is the door jammed? That's so unfair. That is unfair. Why do I get more scared when like they're just there like in the door and i'm and i don't even get scared in the jump scares how nice oh so guys ignore the background um that's my dad vacuuming um mm, i'm probably gonna make this a series to be honest um um i cannot do anymore because i don't want you guys to have to watch that long because you don't need to. You could just go on to the next video when you want, but we don't have next videos yet. So, ignore the noise. Um, I hope you guys have a fantastic day, and I'll see you guys next time.
Peace out.